Good morning, Atlantic Coast High School. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance and remain standing for a moment of silence. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please remain standing for a moment of silence. Thank you. Please be seated. It's Wednesday, May 26th, and welcome to the Morning Rays. Class of 2022, are you interested in competing in the Miss Atlantic Coast pageant over the summer? If so, please complete an online interest form which you can find at the link in the bio of the Morning Rays Instagram page. The girls' tennis, girls' golf, and marathon high teams are welcoming new members from all grade levels for next school year. If you'd like more information about any of these teams, please visit the table in the cafeteria today during all lunches where you can see Mrs. Dixon for girls' tennis and Mr. Kushner, that's me, for girls' golf and marathon high. Sports physical exams are required on a yearly basis for all students who participate in athletics. We've got free sports physical exams taking place next Friday, June 4th, here at Atlantic Coast. It's not a school day, but if you'd like a free sports physical, make sure you are here outside the gym between 9 a.m. and 11 a.m. next Friday, June 4th. If you haven't noticed, textbooks can be turned in at student entrances each morning on your way into school. If you're ready to turn those textbooks in, just find the nearest cart at the student entrances each morning. As for your laptop, if you're staying at Atlantic Coast or in Duval County Public Schools, go ahead and keep your computer over the summer. If you are transferring out of the district, be sure to turn your computer into the media center before this school year ends. Starting tomorrow, backpacks will not be allowed on campus during the final five days of school. Because these final five days are half days, students may pick up a wristband from the cafeteria each morning in order to get a bagged lunch before leaving school beginning tomorrow. Here's the daily schedule for the next two days. You can see we'll go to four classes each day. The first three are an hour long. The last class is seventh period, and it's 30 minutes long. Class of 2022, during the final hour of school tomorrow, you will be in the auditorium for a meeting in which you'll learn everything you need to know about being a senior next year what to expect during your senior year. That's what will be discussed during tomorrow's meeting for current juniors and soon-to-be seniors in the auditorium between 10 and 11 a.m. A reminder that the half days will continue next week. Monday is Memorial Day. Then we have Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday is the final day of this school year. Don't forget, activity buses are no longer available after school, so please make other plans for transportation home. A reminder that if you have ordered a yearbook, you can pick it up in room 502 during lunch or after school. Yearbooks can also be purchased in room 502 for $100 cash only. If you'd like some free tutoring for the ACT over the summer, then please visit our school's website for more information about a couple tutoring sessions that are available, but space is limited. Underclassmen, don't forget to submit your community service hours to your counselor before the end of this school year. And finally, there's a few new videos for you to watch on our YouTube channel, which can be found by searching for Atlantic Coast High School TV Production. We've got a video from behind the scenes at yesterday's graduation. Also, a look at the senior award ceremony from last week. 
and the annual senior video is available to watch and enjoy on our YouTube channel, which again can be found by searching for Atlantic Coast High School TV Production. Those are all the announcements for today. Have a great day, and go Stingrays!